got a movie role, you're a lead in. But just as, I mean, you rewind back some years, when just as a guy that looked like Tupac, right. were you able to get some pussy off of that? Whoa, 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 oh. whoa. <laughs> There are three things wrong with gangster rap. It is obscene, it is obscene, it is obscene. You're trying to start a positive movement for black people by using negative symbolism like thug and outlaw. You gotta enter in somebody's world in order to lead them out. Talk about pressure, man. I mean, no, what pressure? Characters what all pressure, the time. man? Come on, man. What pressure now, man? You play that character. <laughs> I mean, people get upset about Avengers characters. You know, know, because right. they so engrossed in it. You know what? Tupac, That's right. Yeah. It for that for the hip hop generation, like people are taking this personally. So, so I mean, do you feel that? Did, did you do you feel the pressure? Like this character, I gotta get it. You know, um, slightly at the beginning, man. Um, just really, the pressure was on myself to be able to get the role. Yeah. Um, Cause I'm like, you know. I told myself that I could do this. I believed in myself that I can do it. And when I, you know, and if I did get it, that I would do it the right way and I would bring it a thousand percent, nothing less than. Um, and so getting the role and, you know, having my coach and LT Hutton, I mean, I felt heavily armed to be able to go in and, and, and do a great job delivering on this role. Yeah. How important was like his story to you before you got the script. I mean, I, I know you probably was like, people was like, hey man, do you know you ever hear you look like Tupac? And right, stuff like right, that. exactly. But I mean, were you all into his story and did you know like a um, lot of the deeds that are revealed in this movie? No, I didn't actually. Um, for me, it was more so the fan of the music, you know, and you know, the, the outgoing, charis charismatic guy that he was. I, I was really just a fan of that from that aspect, but um, diving into the role gave me a whole different perception and understanding of his life and you know just trying my best to apply all the layers of who he was yeah. for, to, you know to the best of my ability to the to the world why the cameras all on me mm. and in the report and all these charges I didn't do nothing I'm charged with being in concert with some guys well, where they at why me because I'm too fucked no, I'm not angry at them. I'm angry at the system. I don't want nobody else to go to jail, you know what I'm saying? But I don't want to go to jail for something I didn't do. I just don't want to be the scapegoat. You know what I'm saying? It's like the only way I know how to live my life is to be responsible for what I do. I mean, you're a, you're, you're a superstar actor now. you you got, <laughs> got a movie role. You're a lead in. But just as, I mean, you rewind back some years, when just as a guy that looked like Tupac, right. were you able to get some pussy off of that? Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Brother, you. I mean, I know. I'm just saying, like, people love Tupac. I wonder, like, how did you have groupies as the guy really? that looked like Tupac? Okay, yeah, let's go. Uh, did I have groupies growing up looking like Pac? No, I, 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 um, I made some friends with when I occasionally, you know, when I was auditioning the yeah. process, yeah. and I had my hair, hair, you know, low and whatever. I made a couple <laughs> friends. I say. <laughs> So Tupac, I mean, you're playing his role, but to me, like, Tupac was a great musician, but I loved him almost as much as an actor. You know, I really loved Gridlocked and yeah. Juice and all these roles. When you look at him as an actor, where do you think he could have went if we would have seen more oh, years man, of come Tupac? On. Tupac would be nominated for something right now. Yeah. Probably won something by now, dude. Yeah. Dude was great. And, and the funny thing is, is that's what he really was into. And that's where his life was really going. Yeah. He wanted to get more into the acting world, you know what I'm saying? Or get fully focused on that. Yeah. Um, and so, you know, he would have been wherever he wanted to be. Yeah. Well, man, uh, thanks for holding down this role and uh -huh. representing Tupac. I Thank appreciate you, man. I appreciate your time, it. Brian. Good Thank luck you. in your career. Thank you so much.